breaking news. Welcome to today's headlines. Enemies of Iboland. Unam Dekanu are sponsoring Ekwa. Oaneze declares. Enemies of Iboland. Unam Dekanu are sponsoring Ekwa. Oaneze declares. So my dear listeners from wherever you're listening from, please stay tuned as I read to these news. Owaneze Indigo Youth Council Worldwide has condemned the alleged five-day sit-in sit-at-home order issued by one Simon Ekba, who claimed to be a disciple of IPOB leader Wendam Dekanu. Within Nigeria, reports that the group has accused Ekba of being sponsored by enemies of Indigo and HIPOB leader Unam Dekanu in a statement issued by its national president, Mazi Oku Unabuike. Unabuike explained that it was now clear that enemies of Igbo land were sponsoring Ekwa because they couldn't imagine any right-thinking person asking people to stay at home for five days in a row when the country's economic woes were getting worse. He urged the people of Southeast to resist a full reign of terror sponsored by Indigo's enemy, V.I. Ekwa. Meanwhile, Kano denied knowledge of any five-day seats at home order, according to Within Nigeria. Kanu, through his lawyer, Ifianye Jufo, denied knowing anything about a 5 day sit at home order issued by a self-proclaimed disciple in Finland, Simon Ekwa. A Jufo in a statement said, Kanu unequivocally stated that he has not ordered any sit at home. He directs that all our people should go about their normal life and businesses without let or hindrance so as not to destroy the social economic life of our people, which have become the envy of all. Destructive activities of some hired marauders who are presently exploiting the temporary absence of Oyedu to cause untold mayhem, vandalism and calamity on our sacred ancestral land were thoroughly discussed. Oyedu reiterated and emphasized his long-held position of distancing himself and his IPOB movement from the illegal and nefarious activities of this God-forsaken element who mean no world for the Indigo and Halaigo. However, in his reaction to Ekwa's claim, the national president of Ohaneze Indibo Youth Council Worldwide noted that we are a few days away from the Christmas and New Year celebration, with a lot of bills for parents to pay, including house rent and school fees by January. But someone who is in faraway Finland, in the comfort of his room is telling parents and breadwinners to stay at home for five days. It is even more curious that the said Ekwal has no regard for Mazi Unamde Kanu's lawyers, yet he claims to be Kanu's disciple. The IPOB leader, Kanu spoke this week through his lawyer that he did not give orders for any seat at home. He spoke on the economic implications on the same people he is fighting for their freedom. So whose interest is Simon Ekpa serving?
a clear analysis of his statements clearly showed that enemies of Indibo paid him to ensure total destruction of the Southeast economy. Both Ekpal and his sponsors are enemies of Indibo and Mazi Unamdikanu. But we will no longer allow their reign of terror to continue. This will not be allowed to happen. Unabu Ikel also appealed to the people of the Southeast to ignore what he called a baseless and senseless order. This is more so as the IPOB leadership has also declared that there is no such seat at home. One is an Indibo Youth Council worldwide has condemned the alleged five-day sit-at-home order issued by one Simon Ekwa, who claimed to be a disciple of IPOB leader Gunam Dikanu. Within Nigeria, reports that the group has accused Ekwa of being sponsored by enemies of indeed will and IPOB leader Gunam Dikanu in a statement issued by its national president, Mazi Oko Enaboike. Unaboike explained that it was now clear that enemies of Igboland were sponsoring Ekpa because they couldn't imagine any right-thinking person asking people to stay at home for five days in a row when the country's economic woes were getting worse. He urged the people of Southeast to resist a full reign of terror sponsored by Indigo's enemies via Ekpa. Meanwhile, Kano denied knowledge of any five day sit at home order, according to Within Nigeria. Kano, through his lawyer Ifia in a GO4, denied knowing anything about a five day sit at home order issued by a self proclaimed disciple in Finland, Simon Ekwa. So, my dear listeners, now we've come to the end of our today's news. Please do drop by at the comment section.